It doesn't just affect the individual, it affects the whole family, the whole support structure. So Alzheimer's affects everybody. Uh, not only the person uh, who's the, the, the victim of this disease, uh, but the whole family, the whole support structure. And so what we need to do is ultimately get to a spot where we can end Alzheimer's, uh, where we can prevent it, where we can cure it, uh, and where we can ultimately stop it. It doesn't have any discrimination on who it affects, and for that reason, it brings us all together. Team Linden Grove! With our industry, we see Alzheimer's so much, uh, not just in our clientele, but also in our own families. So the Alzheimer's Association is something that really supports both sides of our lives. And so it's really important to a lot of our workers that also come out here on Saturday on their own time because they want to participate and it matters to them as well. It's definitely something that's impactful to me and more importantly today on this day, it's very poignant and beautiful to see all of these people gathered here because this is why I'm doing what I'm doing, it's for them. It's just incredible how many people are um, affected by this disease and then one of the signs I saw said that one in three elderly people die from either dementia or Alzheimer's and that's let's see one yeah. two <laughs> and we have a sister three <laughs> but you know it's not just our our parents and our grandparents but it's us too the flower means they've lived it everyone who raises that flower I know I know that you know how tough it is and you're here to help but there's a frustration in that we got to do better. Put it higher on the list of things that need to be addressed. This white flower, it just fills my heart with love and hope because this is for the person, our first survivor of Alzheimer's. We know that person is out there. We don't know yet who they are going to be, but that white flower represents that person.